Hello again Concord, this is Matt Cashman. Today we're standing outside of Concord High School. We, a couple months ago we did an update of the Concord STEAM project and we wanted to do an update for you today and show you the progress that we're making. Right over my shoulder is a 1400 square foot addition which is going to house six natural gas fired boilers. Those boilers, if you remember, are going to replace the steam that was lost about a month ago when Concord Steam shut down. So let me take you in and show you some details of the inside of the building. So we, before we go into the boiler room, the 1400 square foot addition, I want you to take a look over my left shoulder. This past November in 2016, we put natural gas lines that did not exist here before in preparation for the new natural gas fired boilers that are going to heat the whole entire school this coming fall. One of the things that makes this project pretty complicated is we had to relocate the whole power going to the entire high school. So behind me you'll see a duct bank which we've opened up. This past winter we actually put this new duct bank in in preparation to tie in to the main feeds to go into the high school. So in the next couple of weeks we'll be doing that work. So now we're inside the physical boiler plant. Right over in this area right here is where we're going to place all six natural gas fired boilers. Some unique things about this building I want to point out. The interior walls are all concrete block, but the outside of this building will be brick, and then we're going to put on the upper section an ethos material. It's a stucco style material that will match and blend in with the existing exterior of the building. When you, when you walk over here, we're going to have two areas where we can walk into the boiler room. You'll have a standard door in this section right here, but we're going to have an overhead door in this section right over here. One of the things I want to show you in close proximity to the existing building and the new building is this area right over here. So over the last couple of months, we had to cut open this, this opening right here, which is going to be a main area to bring the boilers in and service them. But you can see, this is the existing structure of the high school that was built in 1996. And this is the new structure. So it's physically tied together, but there'll be an extreme firewall separating the two. Oftentimes in project, what we do is we make a mock-up wall. So over here, you'll see a mock-up of exactly the lower half of the addition that we're going to be building mirrors what it already exists on the building. So this, this mock-up wall is approved by our architect and will be the whole lower level of this new addition. I talked earlier about the EFIS material, and if you take a look up here, that also is going to be matched to the upper portion of the addition that we're going to be doing. So that wraps up our tour at Concord High School. One of the things I want to report is at the end of September, this project will be complete and will be ready for the heating season come fall of 17. The other good news is Abbott Downing and Crystal McAuliffe, our two elementary schools that were on Concord Steam, they will be fully operational, ready for heat in July of this year. And Runlet Middle School is on track to be complete by the end of August of this year. So very pleased with the progress we're making and we'll do more updates in future videos to come.